What is up, everybody? Welcome to the UA Live Break page. Donnie Rollins here bringing you guys some UA Live Breaks, as you'd assume, obviously. We've got a bunch of boxes listed for you guys tonight. You guys absolutely knocked it out of the park with some pre-fills. We pre-filled up, pre up more than we have in quite some time. So we appreciate you guys and all your support for us over here at Ultimate Autographs. We are going to get right into the swing of things. We have our brand new complete NFL jersey series. We have the last couple of our Catch-22 mini helmets. We've got our Naughty or Nice boxes. We have our complete NFL boxes as well for our full-size helmets. <clears throat> that got listed, I think, today. So we have two new series posted for today, if I'm not mistaken, in the jerseys and the full-size helmets. Going to finish up Catch-22, Naughty or Nice. Let's have a little bit of fun. Let's see what we got. Man, everything was full tonight. Love to see it. Josh, yeah, head over. We posted some more stuff on the website. So if you guys are interested in jumping in and helping us pre-fill uh, the rest of the stuff that we have posted or, or, or do some live fills, was not dangerous last night. Let's change that. Let's get into our dice roll for tonight. Got to be a six or higher. UA Live Break Room Rules State. It's got to be a six or Ooh, long dice roll. Eleven. Six and five makes eleven. That works for me. First break of the night is going to be Catch-22 Mini Helmet Break number one. We got Matt Chandler, Peter, Jeremy, Matt, Kevin, Chris, Cheryl. First time for Cheryl and Dustin Harmon closing us out in Catch-22 Break number one. First time for me jumped into a few thanks to friends. Peer pressure. Love to see it. Thank you for jumping in. We appreciate it. 58 and 60. Appreciate you guys calling up the box number two. We're going to have a fun show tonight. We got a lot on the schedule. We got to fly through these pre fills. Let's get some live fills going. Get some more stuff posted as we continue to sell out some breaks. And let's have some fun tonight. 8, 9, 10, and 11. Here we go. Kevin Malloy up to Matt Chandler. Catch 22. Two box break. Break number one. We talked some sports too. 58, 60. Talking about the Saturday games tomorrow. Just a few minutes. I already got my picks scheduled for tomorrow. I think tomorrow there's kind of a couple layups. Over-unders are a little bit teasy, but we'll see what happens. A couple layups tomorrow on Saturday. 58 to 60. Let's rock and roll, guys. Thank you again for joining us. U8 Live Break Style. First hit of the night. Like I said, we pre-filled up a bunch of boxes. So, we will be rocking and rolling through these first couple. Mini number one, we got a Redskins Riddell Amp going to the NFC East, and it's Mr. Dustin Harmon with box number one. It is freezing in here. Dustin, good hit. 3-8. Boom. Redskins. Washington Redskins, that's a beautiful home. Now called the Washington football team. Because the fact that Joe Theismann played for the Redskins when they were called the Redskins. I think we can we can grant him an okay to say that. Dustin, good hit. First mini of the night. First mini of the night. Catch 22, box number 60 of 60. Ooh. JSA COM. Oh, tell you what, tell you what, we got a young gun here in the secondary for the Oakland Raiders, and I believe it was him that had a couple big pass interference penalties against him last night. That is going to the AFC West. That is Trayvon Mullen for Kevin. Kevin Malloy. You like to see those current guys. That's fun. 38101. Oh. Kevin Malloy, Trayvon Mullen, speed mini. There we go. He's a second year guy. Or might be a rookie, actually. He's a young kid, man. Rookie, second year guy. Trayvon Mullen, secondary player. They shut down Keenan Allen, though. Just one catch. In a loss. In a loss. Yeah, he played bad. He did not play good yesterday. It was a tough task, though, for the young one. You know Justin Herbert was going to come out and throw about 150 passes. So. so that's that. 
Mini break number one, catch 22 down. Let's go into Jersey. Jersey number one. We just did 58 and 60, guys. I'm going to try my best to keep up with our running list here. Jersey 16 through 23. 16 through 23, if you guys are ready to rock and roll on our first Jersey break of the night. That's a brand new series, some new headliners. Uh, Lawrence Taylor, Joe Montana, OJ Simpson, Bob Greasy. We also have a, a really cool Michael Vick jersey in there. And uh, Ryan Tannehill, Nike license jersey. Some of the potential hits in that series. Come on, UA Live Breaks. We have Brian Greasy listed as a headliner for the New Jersey. Yeah, for the, for the New Jersey. Right. He is not falling into the category uh, for the New Jersey uh, area. It's a little bit far away from the New Jersey area. Good old Miami. But it's a cool hit. Bob Grease. 20! Oh, do I have 20? Number 20. Let me go to Spanish. Number 20, back at COA! Oh, beautiful hit! This could be a headliner, too. This is a sneaky good hit for the... Uh, Alabama Crimson Tide. Alabama Crimson Tide going to the Pittsburgh Steelers. Minka Fitzpatrick. Minka Fitzpatrick. AFC North for Jason Barrett. Number one. Good hit. I like that little, little Alabama. Hit. Go into the AFC North. 3 8. 3 8. Go. Uh, yeah. Yeah, Ryan, we got you in for a free spot. Have to check and see which one you're in, but we definitely have you for a free spot from that mega break. Minka. That's cool. Hit. I like that. Steelers fan, college football fan. This is a cool hit, man. I haven't seen a ton of Minka College stuff. I've seen some Steelers here and there, but I can't argue with that. Jason Barrett. Any relation to R.J. Barrett, New York Knicks second year guard? We hope so. That'd be pretty sweet. That'd be pretty sweet. No relation. That's unfortunate. You could just lie and say, yeah, it would be way cooler. Could be Michael Barrett, ex-Chicago Cubs catcher. That's true. Moving into our first full-size break of the night. First full-size break of the night is going to be Naughty or Nice. A helmet series where we open up a helmet box. And inside, there was a ticket that says, nope, Jason, no. <laughs> Not nah, man. It's okay. You're almost there. We're going to think of another bear. Uh, Naughty or nice, open up a box. Inside the helmet box is a ticket in each box that states that the box is naughty, meaning the helmet is the only thing you win, or nice, meaning that there is a little bit more that you are going to win with that helmet break. Naughty or nice, number one. Getting closer and closer to selling out that series, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, and 49. Naughty or nice, full-size helmet boxes. Friday night magic here in the UA Live break room. Let's have some fun. Let's open up some more boxes. Like I said, we got a lot of pre-fills, so I'm going to be speeding through a couple of these. Let's get caught up with some of the live fills, too. We don't guys waiting all night to see what they bought into. That's on me. Do we have a box number for naughty or nice number one? 44 through 49. Good. Never liked Michael Barrett. Glad some. You know what? I like Michael Barrett because he punched AJ Brzezinski in the face. Big fan of Michael Barrett because of that. Loved it. Loved that. That was one of the best moments I had as a coach. 
He rocked Daisy Christensen. It was great. Mackenzie says, any more catch 22? Yeah, Mackenzie, we actually sold out of the two. We only had two, uh, two catch 22 breaks left. We sold them out both before we started. All right, let's go ahead and randomize our boxes. Not here, nice number one. Seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. Forty-nine. Box number forty-nine. Box forty. Not your nice series number two. Coming down to the wire here, trying to finish up these not your nice boxes. Have something else fun in mind for our next holiday series. Here we go, guys. Thank you very much for helping us fill it up. Let's see what we got. First hit. Oh wow, Minnesota Viking, perfect. Here's a name we never see in the UA Live Breaks. First time I've pulled one of his helmets. It is Captain Kirk Cousins. Jeremy, what a beauty. That is awesome. Seriously. That's sweet. Jeremy, what a beauty. See what else we got. We got Oh, naughty card. Got a naughty card for the naughty or nice break number one, but a Kirk Cousins is awesome. Playing against the Bears this weekend. Hopefully we see very little Kirk Cousins. Adam Thielen and Justin Jefferson. Kyle Big Country Rudolph. That is a speed replica. You like that? You like that? Love that. Gotta love a little Kirky Cousins. That's a sweet hit, though. We never see Cousins. I like that a lot. I like that a lot. Hey, Ryan, we have you in jersey break number three, my man. Jersey break number three, you got your free spot. Ryan A. Okay. Man. Pretty filling up some boxes today. We got complete helmet number one. Uh, speed replica on the cousins. Speed rep on the cousins. Okay, there we go. Do we have a box number? The all day, yeah, we finished the all day last night trying to get a new platinum helmet series for this weekend, along with the new mini helmet series. Nine, ten, and eleven. Box number twenty-four. Tyler Hammerman, appreciate it. Tyler Hammerman, twenty-four. Righty. Righty. 24. Here we go. Seal on top, seal on the bottom. Woo! Back at COA. Back at COA. Take a look at this. Headliner magic in our first break for the complete helmets. Going to the NFC South, the Mr. Harmon. What a beauty. Warren Sapp. Complete NFL helmet break. 38098, you beast. Dustin. What a beauty. Hey, Rob, just a quick thing. I didn't pull the AP and neither did Garrett, so that may have gone retail. I know you tried to, uh, I know you bought retail before. Maybe that's uh, sent to your house, but that AP potentially have gone retail. Neither Garrett or I have opened that box. Warren Sap! Eclipse, speed rep. Warren Sap, let's go. That's a beaut. Signed in that red. Big old Buccaneers logo. Dustin, congrats, my man. That is a beautiful full size help. Catch that. NFC South. Boom. Bang. Bomb. Bing. Bo. Catch 22. 
Number two. The energy is high tonight. Chad's flowing. We're flowing. We got some boxes flowing. Let's keep it going. That's a nice run. How about that? Can't get that anywhere else. Chris Gibson, Aaron, two box. Catch 22 mini helmet break. We got two boxes left in the series. Let's see if there's anything we missed in this series. Where are we at? Let's get it. What's up, Sean? 57. 57 to 59. We got a Beckett COA. Beckett COA. Mini number three for the night is a Bob Lilly. I know we were just talking about the Cowboys in the chat. Somebody was talking about the Cowboys. That one is going to Sierra Harmon. Sierra Harmon. I think that's the sister of Dustin. The Harmon household is cleaning up. Bob Lilly Hall of Fame class of 1980. And catch, catch me outside 22. Break two. Mr. Cowboy. One of NFL's top 100 players of all time. Awesome. That is fantastic. I love that. Box number one, a little Cowboys hit for Sierra in the NFC East. Box number two. Nice helmet have along with Charles. Oh. This guy's getting a lot of PT this year. PT, of course, playing time. Back at COA. Oh, Packers hit. like that. That's cool. Haven't seen this guy much, but I think his value is a little bit up as well with the success of the Packers passing game. I hear his name a couple times a game. Aaron. That is Jace Sternberger. Go Pack Go. Aaron. Jace Sternberger. He's like a tight end. Kind of like a wing back almost. Plays tight end, blocks well. Big guy. I think he used to have long, flowy hair. Aaron, good hit on the Jace Sternberger. Any offensive player for the Packers is good with me. Catch 22 series is done with. Thank you guys for all the support in that mini helmet series. Absolutely killed it with that series, man. That series was awesome. Pulled that Emmett Smith camo. That was great. Donnie, when are they gonna fire Nagy? Well, after not not after this last week against the uh, against the Texans. Alrighty. Let's do uh, complete jersey number two. Complete jersey number two. We got 16, 17, 18, 19, 21, 22, and 23. And number 11. 11 times on the dice roll. Xavier Torrey on the bottom. David Sparks. Up at the top. Let's rock and roll. We got a first time purchase for Xavier. Xavier Torrey. Jimmy Mallon, Christ 24. Complete jerseys. Jimmy Mallon, 23. All right, 23. That works. Jimmy, thanks for calling out the box numbers. I appreciate it. 23 like MJ. You want it? Oh. Let's get that camera nice. Nice knock with the box. Wanted Kobe's number. Settle with the GOAT with MJ. Box 23. My Bama Fitzpatrick jersey was first time hurts. That's awesome. That is really cool. Congrats, man. Awesome hit.
Shaq Barrett and uh, Ace Ace Dank 05 with the Drew Lock Noah Fant Dual Eclipse Authentic. Remember it like it was yesterday. Guess what? Shaq Barrett. Love that. I really screwed up the camera. Sierra, nice hit, congrats. That was good. <laughs> That's true. That is... I would have to say, Donnie, that you and Garrett are the best. Thank you for professionals and good work you guys do. Chris, thank you very much, my man. I appreciate that a lot. That is nice of you. We try. Try to be professional. Let me try. Woo! Complete helmet two, let's go! Complete helmet break number two. 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. No 24. No 24. Twenty six. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. Box twenty six. M pack teased. I don't know how to say that. I appreciate that very much, guys. Thank you for the nice comments. Matt, Dave, Bill, Chris. Take a peek at the comment section. Absolutely killing. 26. Let's do it. Is that a MPAC? What's the full name on that account? So I know you're in the break. Because we let the people in the breaks call out the boxes. Jason, oh sweet, you got it. That is an interesting name, I like that. Jason, I like that. 26! Yeah, you did, Aaron, you hit a Jace Sternberger Packers mini. Don't be late again. I'm missing out. Beckett, COA. Jason, thanks for calling out the box numbers. Hit number two in the complete helmets. 2020 Hall of Famer. Throwback. Chicago Bears. Replica helmet. Going to Christopher Wells. Three. Christopher Wells with the Jimbo Covert. I used to call him Jumbo Jim Covert, and someone called me out for that. So now I call him Jimbo Covert. He's not. 
Not Jumbo Jim. I mean, anyone that's a bigger guy with the name Jim, you can call him Jumbo Jim. I feel like that's a pro that's not a problem. I got called out bad on the stream one day. Dude, what the heck? It's not his freaking name. Learned my lesson there. Chris Wells, nice hit. 2020 Hall of Famer. Chicago Bears. Jimbo Covert. Man, I mean, naughty or nice number two. Naughty or nice number two. Peter, Dustin with three spots. Stan, Jason Campbell. Let's rock and roll. Not wrong. Thank you. I feel like I made a couple good points here per night. Some agreeable points. Hello? Naughty or nice too? We got box 45. Box 45. Yeah. Uh, oh, sorry. Not gonna happen. If anybody else is in the break and would like to call on box number, please let me know. I knew a tall guy named Jim. We called him Jimbo or Jumbo. Either one. Ooh, Hex Lumpkin says Devontae Adams pull. Gibbs says he's in for a triple complete. Guys, let me know. What do you think? Let me know. All right, we're here to randomize our boxes. Naughty or nice, number two. You know what? These are the wrong numbers. Sorry. We're doing naughty or nice, Donald. Not, not complete, you fool. All right. Bodie Bo! That's 20 Bo. Old TI saw. 44 of 50, guys, good luck, and thank you for helping us fill up another naughty or nice box. Another naughty or nice break. Some love for Jim Everett in the chat, love to see that. Hold on a second. Hex Lumpkin. You and I are going to have to chat about uh, future future lottery numbers because you called it right on the money. Unbelievable stuff. NFC North headliner. Jason Campbell. It is Devontae Adams. Unreal. Dang, how did you... How did you know that? Please tell me the little lotto for tomorrow. Let me know what numbers to play. Let me know what the spreads are going to be on the Bills. <laughs> Bills, Packers. That is awesome. Devontae Adams, Riddell, Amp. Will we follow it up with anything else, Jace? Let's see. Definitely no problem with that. We'll take that Devontae all day. Bills by 40, baby. That is a stellar. Riddell Amp. Devontae, that's a headliner. That is a headliner. Jason Campbell, beauty, my man. Beautiful hit, my man. Let's go. We're rocking. Let's keep it going. We got uh, complete jersey number three. Complete jersey three. Complete helmet four is already full. Complete helmet five is posted. Complete jersey. Let's run another jersey. That's a speed rep. Not bad, though. Jersey 16, 17, 18, 19, 21, and 22. Complete jersey break numero trois. 
And for you non-French speakers, that is three. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Double sticks. That's a cool way to say 11, you know? Box number for the jersey. 16, 17, 18, 19, 21, 22. Cade. Cade number 17. You got it, dude. And our hit is JSA COA. Our hit is a excuse me, Indianapolis Colt. Indianapolis Colts. Man, a guy who's probably forgotten about in this organization because of the rookie running back, Jonathan Taylor, went off last week, and Naheem Hines is playing good. Jordan Wilkins is another good option for them. But this was their number one back to start the year. This was their number one back to start the year. That's Marlon Mack. And when he comes back, he'll be fantastic. Man, I should have rhymed that. I could have done better. AFC South for Cade. Cade called the box number and knocked down a Marlon Mack autographed jersey. Marlon Mack met him in person, one of the nicest guys on the planet. Jersey three. I like Marlon Mack. I wish him great success in Indianapolis or wherever he plays. I know Jonathan Taylor's probably their go-to guy in the future. But Hines is good. Wilkins is good, too. They have three good running backs over there. I need a lot of Jonathan Taylor this week. This is a blue. This is a blue. It's like a dark blue. Pretty sweet. I know, right, Ace? Afterthought, and he's, he may be the most talented of the bunch. For him to be an afterthought, he's good when he plays. Marlon Mack sensation. When Marlon Mack plays, he's a guy to have on your fantasy team. Now, he catches passes, he runs the ball for a lot of yards per carry. And never forget that he was very nice to a young Don Rollins once. Donnie Gibbs comments won't show up on here, haven't for months. Any idea why? I have no idea. Maybe, maybe he said something inappropriate and we blocked him. It's probably not true. <laughs> but I, I actually have no idea. Haven't for months. What is he trying to use? Is he trying to use uh, YouTube? You can try to make a Twitch account or go from Facebook. We do three separate streaming platforms at once. I was trying to hit up another one of those. Not sure why his, his comments wouldn't be working though. Seventeen is gone. Complete helmets. Nineteen. Twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-five. JT got him when they give him the JT got him. Yeah. JT's awesome. He is good. Wisconsin kid, Jonathan Taylor. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Guys, thank you very much for all your support up to this point. We very much appreciate you helping us pre-fill up a bunch of these boxes. We got complete helmet break number three. If you guys would like to give me a box number, we will run it. Nineteen, twenty, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-five. All righty, we will randomize our box numbers. No problem at all. I'm just trying to keep it going. We're moving right now. We got a lot of high energy, so I'm just trying to keep this thing a rolling, high speed. 8, 9, 10, and 11. 
21. 9 plus 10. 21. Step your mean game up. Here we go. Best of luck, everybody. Thank you guys for the fill, and let's rock and roll. Hex just missed it, man. We like to, uh, once we start that dice roll, we do not like to stop it for the randomizer. But if you'd like to comment just a second earlier. Bothering you again, Donnie. Send that Mullen Mini to Grayson. We made a trade. He's sending me something from his PC. Please and thank you. Got it. I'll write that down in a second. Open up this Mini. Let me open up this mini, show this one off. I like this one a lot. Back at COA. Look at this. Houston Oilers throwback. This is a really cool piece of autograph memorabilia. Really cool piece of autograph memorabilia. For the South. Alex H. Earl Campbell. Oilers throwback. This is the exact helmet you'd want from Earl Camp, I think. Just the style he would have wore, that big old logo, beautiful black ink. It's a perfect helmet. Big fan of that. It's that throwback replica, but it looks amazing on the shelf. That ink pops. Big fan of this helmet. Pulling it here, UA Live Breaks, complete helmet listing. All right, we have Kevin that traded the Trayvon Mullen Mini to Grayson Wagner. Let me write that down before I forget, which is very possible. Kate says, that's hard. Hard in a good way. I'm assuming. number three. Grayson says, Donnie, how are you going to feel when the Raiders trade Mariota to the Bears after this season? I won't be super disappointed. Do I think the Bears will? I hope not. But I think we need to work on other stuff before we try and fill in our quarterback position. Uh, we need to try and get more front office help. 48. Alex, thanks for calling out the box number. We could use some offensive line personnel. Ethan, happy 47th birthday. You know what they say, they, you look your youngest on your 47th birthday. Love that. Trubisky is better than Mariota. He looked legit. Hopefully we can get something for him. Lots of bad QBs. <laughs> I would say you're not losing a ton by trading Trubisky for Mariota, but you're not gaining enough to make that deal happen, in my opinion. In my opinion, I wouldn't do that. Oh, this is cool. Back at COA. Back at COA, how about this? For the North, yet again, we got a Riddell, Matt Black, Mike Singletary. That says Samurai Mike inscription as well who has got the nfc north Woo! jeanette great hit jeanette that's fantastic now you're nice number three that's beautiful 
dispute. Jeanette, here we go. Do we have anything else? Yes, we do. Not only are you going to get a Mike Singletary, Riddell, Matt Black headliner hit, you will be getting a free pull from Santa's bag. And let's see what else we got for you, Jeanette. Ryan's a Packer fan, unfortunately. Oh, wait, what did he... Donnie, ship my Sternberger to a Packer fan. Merry Christmas for me. Oh, man, that's very nice of you. Aaron, appreciate that a lot. That's very, very nice of you. Uh, posting more minis. We actually sold out of our mini helmet series for tonight. Feeling like Kareem Hunt tonight because I'm going to be hitting. <laughs> Comment of the night. So far. Comment of the night. Love a good Kareem Hunt comment. That's, that is rich. That is rich. Here we go. Santa's bag. We got a pull for Jeanette. Right off the top. Right off the tippity top. Jeanette, let's see what else we got for you. See what else we got for you. 25 in UA cash. $25 UA cash for Jeanette. That's cool. Jeanette, congrats. Two awesome hits. Free money and a Mike Singletary. Cordell Matt Black helmet. Great break for Jeanette in the NFC North. Keep on rocking and rolling. Ryan says, Diane just did a personal purchase and forgot to hit open that thing live. Ryan, it looks like it's going to have to wait two to three weeks because our shipping is behind, and uh, and that's going to ship out on Monday. So, sorry. Just kidding. Tell me what box number you'd like from what product, and I'll open right here for you. We can show off your Christmas present. And I'm proud of you for spoiling yourself for Christmas, as we all should. Complete helmet number four, 23. You got, uh, can we get complete helmet? You got it. Complete helmet, 23, you should have. It's complete helmet break four. 10, 11. Dustin and Sierra want to win bad. They'd like to win this one. Ryan, you got it. Let's put you in the personal stab. I think we got 23, we'll take off the list. Take 23 right off the list. Complete helmet, you got it, my man. Complete helmet number four, there's everybody's divisions. We got 19, 20, 22, and 25. Sorry, Jason and John, you're running into a buzzsaw. That, I do not advise that. That would be terrible. Do we have a box number? If not, got a 12% chance. <laughs> hey, 12 is 12 better than zero. Can't, can't argue that. If you guys want to give me a box number, we'll give you one more sec. If not, we'll randomize, no problem. Gotta be 22. So you're telling me there's a chance. 
break number four. And a beautiful hit. Lance Brink, Chicago Bears, speed rep, and a beauty. I love Kingman. <laughs> That's a great hit, man. Love Lance Brink. One of the coolest dudes on the planet. When we do signings, big fan of Lance. John, congrats on the Chicago Bears pull. Looks good to me. Our tree! Congrats. Jerseys. Jerseys are rocking. Complete helmets are rocking. Jersey number five is a double box break. Not your nice number four is posted. Complete helmet six is a triple. Let's go. John, thank you. Complete jersey four. Do we have a box number? Uh, one, two, three, four, five. 16, 18, 19, 21, 22. 16, 18, 19, 21, 22. I got like a belt on. It's bugging me. Not 11. Ethan says, shout out Mike on the old Jack Daniels binger. Yep. Shout out Mike for that. That guy's awesome. 18. I can't stand Danny Trevathan because the helmet to helmet hit on Adams last year. That was clean. Clean. <laughs> Kevin, thanks for calling out the box numbers. I appreciate it. COA. And our hit is sick. Sick hit. This is super rare. I love this. We got ourselves a college jersey. We got ourselves a college jersey and it is ex-Vikings quarterback. Also played for the Lions. Dante Culpepper in the University of Central Florida Knights. That goes to Aaron W. Uh, number four on the jersey. Awesome hit, Aaron. Three, eight. One. Dante Culpepper. That's cool. Never seen this college jersey before. Big fan of that. Boom, 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 boom. Dante. Thank you, man. Well done. It's a cool hit. I like that. All right. Jersey four. Let's get, uh, so we got naughty or nice number four. Naughty or nice number four. Okay, two spots. Alex with a spot on the bottom. And good luck, guys. Here we go. Six, 
We got 45, 46, 47. All right, 46, not your nice. 46. Good luck, guys. Thanks for another fill up on our Naughty or Nice series. Here we go. This might be a hidden headliner. I don't know if this was advertised a headliner, but it should have been. CD Lamb for the Cowboys. Going to the East for Cade. Cade, that is a beaut. CD Lamb, Riddell, Matt White. CD Lamb. pull from Santa's pad. Let's go. Great box. Headliner helmet and some additional winnings. Let's go, man. Okay, the killer. Box four. Get Santa's bag over here. Okay, pulling right off the top. Right off the top. Now let's see what you got. Okay, and you have ten dollars UA cash. Ten dollars in UA cash to go along with the CD Lamb hit. Uh, speed rep, speed rep on that one. Yeah, the Naughty or Nice will be a lot of reps. We did have a couple pro lines in there, though. We did have a couple pro lines in there. Congrats, Kate. Nice hit, man. Boom. Man. Complete helmet five. Single box. We got nine, uh, 19, 20, and 25. 19, 20, 25. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Cool. Cool, cool. Let's go. You guys got a box number for me? This is a single box break. JSA COA. And our hit is this is a uh, University of Nebraska guy. Oh, cool hit. This is nice. I like that new Rams look. Who's got the West? Steve Myers. Steve Myers in the West in break number five. That is Vince Ferragamo. 1979 NFC champs as well. That's cool. Three, eight, one. Three, one. Steve Myers in the West. University of Nebraska star. Quarterback for the Rams. NFC champs. Pretty cool. On that new Rams helmet too. I like that. Like that. Something 
something a little different on full size. Donnie, how many boxes are left in the Naughty or Nice? Looks like I got two. Looks like I got two. Complete jersey number five. Double box break. We got 16, 19, 21, and 22. 16, 19, 21, 22. Two boxes. -na 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 -na. Call it what you want. Name that artist. Call it what you want. <laughs> Chris Hanna, just for you. Appreciate it. Jason Ricker, he wants to win a jersey. He's got four spots at a double box break. Dustin Herman, first two. Alex H. Can we get two box numbers? Call it what you want. Why is it a man? LaVisca Chanel, that's a cool hit on the Eclipse. I like that. Two boxes. Alright, we'll randomize. Knows the song? Band? Not the band. I don't know. Is that a band? The group? I don't know if it's a band. It's a good question. 19 and 22. 19 22. 19 22. Lawrence Taylor hit incoming. Thanks. If you get both of those right, I'll be very impressed. I'll be very impressed if you get both of those. You hit Devontae earlier. Can we see the Lawrence Taylor? I, won't, I mean, I'll just be, like, nervous. You know, what else do you know? What else do you know? PSA COA. Boom. Hey, cool hit. First time I'm pulling this guy. Cool hit. This guy had a huge catch in the Super Bowl where Eli Manning beat Tom Brady. Awesome hit for the Giants, the G-Man, David Tyree. David Tyree. I don't think I've seen him yet. That's cool. Going to Chris Hannon, just supporting, turns into a win. Uh, Jersey 5, double. 38160. Good hit, David Tyree. Foster the people. Foster the people, anybody. They also sing very popular Pumped Up Kicks, which has a very, very dark backside. I don't want to spoil that song for you, but dang, that song has a very dark story behind it. Jam, though. Can't argue with that. That is a straight-up jam. 22! Foster the people. Would that be a band? Or is that an electronic group? Or... I just be, I don't know. Speaking of myself, it's fine. 22, here we go. Oh, sick. JSA COA. This is awesome. Whole lot of ink on this one. Whole lot of ink here. We got three autos on this jersey. It is the Los Angeles Chargers Air Corey Yell. Or Air Corey Yell. Air Corey, yeah, we got Charlie Joyner. We have Kellen Winslow, and we have Wes Chandler. Who's got the West? That's a headliner. Dustin Harmon. That is an awesome jersey. <laughs> I 
That's cool. Nothing on the front. This is one that needs to be framed. Is anybody... Dustin, if you want me to hold on to this for the frame, let me know, man. This, this may deserve a frame. This deserves a frame, in my opinion. Very cool piece. Air Cordial, triple signed jersey. Triple signed jersey. That's really cool. Very rare to see that kind of stuff. What's this? Jersey double. We have complete helmet number seven. It's a triple. Not your nice five is posted. But for now, we got another complete helmet break. Triple. I gotta grab. Let me run and grab. One, two for this break. Two more. Oh, one more. Yeah. All right. Be right back. I gotta grab three, four more boxes. Okay, let's go. Triple helmet complete helmet. <laughs> Triple complete helmet break. 1920. Nope. 1916. I'm all over the place. What do I have? 16. 16. 19. 20. 1. 1. No. Oh, I'm an idiot. Nineteen twenty-five, twenty, uh, twenty-seven, twenty, twenty-nine, thirty. That's it. That's it. There you go, Don. Figured it out. Three boxes. You guys want to give me three box numbers? Okay, no 22. This is complete NFL helmets. Complete NFL helmets. Nineteen, sixteen. What is the T A T? Sixteen, nineteen, twenty-two. We have nineteen. No sixteen, though. No. So complete helmets. We got, we got nineteen. Nineteen will work, Kate. Okay. Just calling out a bunch of boxes. Got to hit the mark with one of them. I know. <laughs> Jeremy wants KC. Triple box break. 1930. One more, Cade. 27. I said we kick this weirdo. Who? <laughs> no problem with that. 19. Sorry. 1927. 30. Got it? Okay, cool. All right, let's do it. All righty. All right. Okay, thanks for calling out the right box numbers. 
<laughs> burn. I burn you. All right, here we go. Ooh, we're going here again. Who do we got? Nice. JSA COA. Numbers are hey, numbers are hard. Don't you dare doubt numbers. Numbers can be hard. NFC West, box one of three. Tight end, Gerald Everett. Gerald Everett, that's cool. NFC West for Ethan. Ethan in the NFC West. Yeah. This is number six. <laughs> Gerald Everett, tight end. Twenty seven. Finally got into a break. I've been bankrolling all my UA cash for. Let's get some fun. Nicely done, Rob. You can use your UA cash on any break spot. You get UA cash every time you purchase. Oh my goodness. Oh, what a duo. Oh, what a duo. Check this out. We're going back to back. Tight ends for the Rams on that new 2020 style helmet. That's Higby. Oh, Ethan, money man. a great hit, Ethan. Ethan M, sorry. Uh, number six. That's cool. Yeah. If you're not a Rams fan before, you're a Rams fan now. Gotta love it. Ethan, well done, man. Tyler Higby and Gerald Everett in the same break. Two of those new speed Rams helmets, too. I like that. But that was a speed... That was a speed. The first one was like that Riddell replica look. Their third tight end? Uh, probably me. Probably me. I have no idea. I don't even think they have a They have two pretty good ones, though. Two current tight ends for the Rams in their first two breaks. Who will box number three? B. Ooh, beauty. JSA COA. Higby running my fantasy team. Ruining? <laughs> yeah, me too. I had it. How about that? How about the Philadelphia Eagles? Starting running back out of Penn State. You may know him as Miles Sanders. Had a long touchdown run against the Saints. New Orleans Saints. Well, how did I forget that? Cade. That's a good one, Cade. A brain fart like no other. Cade, good hit. 38158. Beauty. Miles Sanders. Three current guys, three current skill position players as well. Love to see that. I consider a tight end a skill position player. Oh, depending on the player. Travis Kelsey. That's a uh, that's a skill position tight end. George Kittle. Skill position guys for sure. Love to see that stuff. Nice hits. We have a little personal. We got a quick second for a personal box 23 for Ryan. Ryan, good luck, my man. Box 23 is all you. Seal on top, seal on the bottom. Let's see what you got. 
Okay. We got a PSA COA. This guy played for the Buccaneers and the Panthers. This is actually his most recent team, a Dallas Cowboy. Dallas Cowboy defensive player. I see his name start coming up again towards the end of the offseason. That is Gerald McCoy. Ryan. Gerald McCoy, 3-1. Gerald McCoy. Cowboys speed replica. Can't ever argue with a Cowboys hit. Can't argue with a nice Cowboys pull. Ryan, good hit. Congrats, brother. Thank you for purchasing the personal. Plenty nice for you, man. Appreciate that. Okay. All right, Jersey. Cool. We got two spots left in our complete jersey number six. We got three spots left in the helmet number seven, triple. Jersey number six, a double. Helmet number seven, a triple. Not your nice five is posted. Let's go. What's going on ESPN right now? What do we got? So we got these scores right now. Ball State and Buffalo. Oh, that's a great game. The MAC Championship is tonight. Ball State and Buffalo. Buffalo minus 13. They were that big of a favorite? We got one spot left in our jersey. Two boxes left in here. Got another triple helmet. We got one spot left to go with that. Nebraska up 28-21 on Rutgers. part of my parlay. Follow me for more losing, more losing bets. <laughs> but they're minus 13. Let's see. Wait. They're up 10. You're not out of it yet. You're not out of it yet, man. Jersey 6 is full. Jersey 6 is full and ready to run. We got two boxes. I'll lose those last two boxes for our break. We got, uh, what do we got? 16 and 21. Our helmets. Uh, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20. All right, guys. Thank you for another fill in our complete jersey. If you'd like to post another jersey, let me know. If you'd like to post another complete helmet, let me know in the chat. We'll get it going. Another one. Pink. 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 All right, guys. Good luck and thank you for another fill. Battle for thirteenth place. In the Big Ten. 16 and 21. 16 and 21 on the jerseys. Grayson, why is it that you are a Nebraska fan? Oh, shit. Oh, no. Here we go. The king. The king. Yeah, Grayson, you're a Raiders fan and a Nebraska Cornhuskers fan. That's an interesting duo. Share with me. Share with me why. Cheers. Nice hit out of Louisville. Wide receiver. Beauty. This kid's a stud, man. This kid's a stud if you ask me. Devontae Parker. 
Devontae Parker. Nice target for Tua Tagovailoa. It's a great hit. Haven't seen many Devontae Parker. I went there for grad school. Most of the fam went there. Cool. And why are you a Raiders fan? Ethan is on fire. 38171. <laughs> That's awesome. Let's go. That's hilarious. Three months. I want to get box number six. Devontae Parker. I'm a Raiders fan because I play, love playing with Rich Gannon in backyard football. He was great in backyard football. I remember, like, Randy Moss was in it one year. Rich Gannon. That's a great, great video game drop. Chief Great. <laughs> Chief Great. Rich Gannon. Yeah, absolutely. Ethan, great hit, man. That's sweet. I woke up today with Ethan. <laughs> 21. First guy in the chat with his own hype person. That's a good hit. OJ. Try to keep it PG, boys. Try to run a clean program here. That's awesome. Nice hits, Ethan. Congrats, man. Devontae Parker and OJ Simpson. Can't argue with that duo. Can't argue with that duo. Complete helmet number seven is a triple box break. Thank you guys for another fill. Guys, again, if there's anything else you'd like us to post, please let me know in the chat. We'll get it going. We will get it going. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Whew. Triple box break for complete helmet break seven. Three, count them, three, 25, 28, 29. Break. JSA COA. JSA COA, first of three. Going to the AFC West in the Denver Broncos. The Denver Broncos will take hit number one. It's Dustin Harmon. Uh, just jumping in. Any more jerseys? Yeah, we can post whatever you guys want. We're still rolling. 3 1, 3 8 1. What if we did another double jersey? That is Rick Upchurch. Rick Upchurch is an ex-Pro Bowl wide receiver, five-time All-Pro wide receiver, number 80. And he is a Denver Broncos Ring of Fame member. All right, let's do it. We'll post another double jersey. 
It'll be double jersey break number seven. Double jersey will be break number seven. That's a Riddell rep. Riddell rep. We'll grab some more Jersey box post it down. This is cool. It's a Beckett COA. There's a Beckett COA. How about this? 49ers action. That's a good hit, too. He's a good player. Fred Warner. For Chris Gibbs. Fred Warner. Chris, good hit there. Speed rep. Speed rep on the Fred Warner. Oh, my words. Third and final box for our triple helmet break. What's up, Robert? Haven't broken any cards yet, Rob. I've not done any cards yet. I want to check out the website. We got some stuff posted. Woo! Back at COA and headliner action. Friday night. Headliner pull. Dustin. It is. Bo Jackson. Bo knows. Let's go. What a beauty. Jersey number seven, the double box break is posted. That's lovely. That's beautiful. If you want to move ahead of Grayson, he was a big Rich Gannon fan back in the day. Now he loves him some Raiders, and he would love to see that Bo Jackson in his living room. In the living room. Uh, that's another speed rep, though. That's a cool helmet, though. That's a cool helmet. Bailey's in for our double jersey. Let me grab two boxes. Let me grab two boxes for this jersey. Two jersey boxes. I missed meeting Bo by 20 minutes. Great hit. He ran a 4-3-40 at Auburn at 2.30. Dang. That is an interesting time in the day to be running a 40-yard dash. But hey, whatever works. Trying to fill up another jersey. 4 1. Still 38 28, Ball State over Buffalo in the MAC championship. We got UAB. Yeah, Robert, for sure. What do you want to do? What are you feeling? Let me know. I'll open them right now. 
Get the old card camera out for you, Rob. Kevin Malloy's in. Bailey Brandon. Double box jersey break. Oregon to USC. That's kind of surprising. USC, number 13, down two scores to Oregon. Nebraska. Grayson, looks like Nebraska may pull this one out, man. Five minutes left. Up a score. Huge Big Ten game. Huge Big Ten game. Took USC minus three and a half. Bet the opposite of Kevin. <laughs> Bet the opposite of Kevin. Cool. It's like, sounds like uh, you're having a rough, rough go. I did some college basketball earlier. I lost one because uh, who was it? It was uh, I had. I was like three or four on parlay, which would have been decent, but the fourth team lost. Who was it? They played Iona. It was it was just a random. I've been dreaming of I've been dreaming of a three and five season. Love the high expectations for the Nebraska Cornhuskers. <laughs> That's good. One spot left to go. Thank you guys for another fill on a two jersey break. I've been dreaming of a three and five season. <laughs> Robert, what card box are you feeling? What are we going to rip for you? Not a lot of sports in that. Irish are ten and zero. I'll do one more spot on the Prism NFL if I we can do them tonight. What do we have taken. We have no spots taken in Prism right now. However, okay, I think I got all the spots. All right, Robert, what do you got? Robert, what are you in on? We'll check in a second. Let's fill up this jersey, and we'll run some cards. Get my little card camera up. Chris Hannon, thanks for the fill, my man. Let's do it. Double box jersey break. Let's do it. Uh, yeah, 24, 25 will work for me, Kev. <laughs> kind of Here we go. First hit is a JSA COA, and it's our pocket Hercules. This is an awesome. I love seeing this. Love seeing a little Maurice Jones drip. Maurice Jones drew for the Jacksonville Jaguars in this nice little, this is a cool jersey, little teal jersey. Teal jersey, Maurice Jones drew. Donnie, I think I've officially transitioned from memorabilia to cards. Yeah, cards are fun, man, I'm telling you. AFC South for Jason. Jason Barrett. I said Jason, that's cool. All right, Rob, we're looking at a Contenders Optic box. That's sick. Uh, 3817. Jason, good hit, man. Maurice Jones Drew. That's for me, huh? For me, I'll leave the tip jar. If you guys want to do any holiday spirit tipping? 
We take cash out. I don't think we've ever gotten one tip, to be honest. 25. <laughs> Neither me or me. That should be shit. Jason, good hit on the MJD. JSA COA. Nice hit, man. This is an awesome jersey break. Two running backs. This time it's Tennessee, Texas Longhorns. <laughs> That's okay. Tennessee Longhorns. Texas Longhorns, Ricky Williams. Ricky Williams. Cool hit. Seen him a lot lately, but never a bad hit. Never a bad pull, Mr. Ricky Williams. That goes to the AFC East. His longest tenure is a Miami Dolphin. Ethan, nice hit, dude. Ethan was on fire. Boom. Boom, boom, bang. Texas Longhorns jersey. That's cool. I like that. All right, Robert, let's do a little contender's optic. Optic Contenders Basketball. Ooh. Robert, I got uh, four boxes. Four boxes. Let me know which one. Uh, let me know which one you want. It'll be one, two, three, four. Uh, Robert, did you get all the spots? Yeah, you did. A little personal. A little personal for you. All right, let's go. Let's get the card caps in. Personal Optic Contenders box for Robert. Robert, again, let me know what box number you'd like. Or which box? One, two, three, or four. Uh, you pick. How about we we'll randomize? You have trust in me. I'll just randomize. Be safe. I have no idea. I mean, there's really no way for me to know. But to be on the safe side, we'll randomize one, two, three, four. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Box one. All right, Rob. Box one. All you. Thank you for helping us fill up a uh, a car break, too. That's awesome. Thank you for buying those spots. Box number one is all you. Come on, baby. Let's see some big hits. Let's see some big time hits. Come on. All right, Rob, you ready? We got a personal here. We got a personal optic contenders box. Robert, let's do it. Good luck, man. Hopefully we hit something big. Hopefully we hit something big here. Robert said he'll, he'll buy some more spots and cards if you guys are interested. You guys got to start the show and he'll finish it is what he's saying. Couple spots in each, couple spots here or there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was gonna, I was gonna randomize the divisions, but let's go. It's like super sensitive. All right, sorry. All right, Rob, let's do it. Let's do it.
One pack. Contenders 1920 Optic. base. So we got a Donovan Mitchell followed by an Aaron Gordon Red. Aaron Gordon Red followed by is this number? These reds are not numbered. Hold on. Followed by a Brandon Ingram. Okay, alright. There we go. Brandon Ingram Orange. To 49. Brandon Ingram orange to 49. Looks like our auto. Let's go. We got a rookie. It's a very nice rookie auto. One of my favorite prospects, to be very honest. I love PJ Washington. Auto looks like it stays on sticker. Up and coming rookie PJ Washington. I like that. That's cool. I love this kid. I think he's a stud. I think he's going to be really good, too. Hold on to that. That's a nice investment piece, Rob, for you. Aaron Gordon. Chris Weber, All-Star Aspirations. Insert. And our last card is a cracked ice. Ben Simmons, front row seat ticket. Cool card. That orange cracked ice. That's cool. I like that. The auto is a P.J. Washington, second-year guy out of Kentucky. He's good, though. He'll be really good. He's got a lanky, like, 6'7". Six, 6'7", seven. Six, seven. what am I telling you? 6'7", out of Kentucky. I like that hit a lot. Robert, I'm going to get these sleeved up really quick, and we'll get those shipped out. I'm going to sort these, sleeve them, and we'll get these taken care of. Robert, nice box, man. I like that P.J. Washington a lot. He's a good player. He is a good player. Okay, let's go. We posted another Optic Contenders. We got another Optic Contenders up. Robert, nicely done. PJ Washington, I like those. I like those. Oh, he filled up Naughty or Nice. Filled up Naughty or Nice helmets. Uh, we got two boxes in here, 45, 47. 45 and 47. Let's try to do some more cards. I'll leave the card camera set up. Leave the card mat out. If you guys want to rip another uh, box of cards, let me know. I'm trying to fill up some spots. We have plenty of cards posted. The uh, Panini Encased is always fun. Panini Encased is fun. Dustin, Jason, Dustin, Jeremy, Bailey, Jeremy, Ethan, and Alex. Let's see, we got Optic 2, Naughty or Nice 6 is posted. Bowman HTA, Panini Prism Football, Bowman Hobby, that'll go Sunday. Kevin C is a Dolphins or Bills here. We shall random our box number. We got two. We'll random. We will randomize our boxes. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Forty-seven. Forty-seven. Naughty or nice. There we go. Seal on top, seal on the bottom, let's do it. And our full size helmet hit. It's Oh, 
messed up. That's right, that's fair. That's good. And our hit! Atlanta Falcons! Atlanta Falcons, this is going to be a Jamal Anderson. Cool, help. I like this. I always like this. Jamal Anderson with the Dirty Bird inscription. I like that. However, we got a naughty tag in that one. NFC South for Jason. Jason. Number five. Three, eight, one, seven, three. Good hit, Jason. That's cool. Parlay or UA, Kevin is running every time. Yeah, Kevin, I stink at parlays too. I got one for tomorrow. I just like to play as much as I can. I think it's just fun. I can just play for fun. Obviously, I don't want to get too serious. Because you never do. That's where you need some help. But I like to try, you know, $5, $10 parlays for NFL games. I think I know what I'm talking about until the games actually start and I'm wrong all the time. 47 was Jason, and it was... The Dirty Bird, Jamal Anderson. That's cool. Let me check on the card breaks. Yet again, Optic Contenders 2 is posted. We have Panini in case number one, Bowman HTA, four spots left. Panini Prism, if you guys are interested in doing any Prism football, we can rip that. Let me know, guys. We'll give it a few more minutes, see if we can fill up anything else. If not, we had a banging Friday here in the UA Live break room. Had a lot of fun, guys. Uh, I will be back. I'm not signing off. I will be back uh, Saturday. So tomorrow I have both shows, 2 and 8. If you guys are interested in jumping in again, I will be back for those. And then we have Garrett on Sunday. So uh, I'll be talking about NFL games all day tomorrow. We got three NFL games tomorrow for Saturday. We got Bills, we got Packers, and we have... Bills... They play the Bronx. No. Why don't I know this? Robert, no, not yet, buddy. If there's anything else you want to do, let me know. Anything else you want to do, let me know, my man. Uh. Was only two games tomorrow? I thought that was a Newton game. Oh, Buccaneers, right? No, they play. Oh, I'm an idiot. Two games tomorrow. Two games tomorrow. Thought there was. So we're going to go. We got Green Bay and the Panthers. We got Buffalo and the Broncos. Buffalo Bills, as of right now, are minus five and a half, with the over under being at 49. I like the Bills minus five and a half against the Broncos. I think that's a good. I think that might be a good number for them. The over-under, the thing that scares me about that over-under is the Broncos, you know, they may be that may be tough to score against the Bills' defense. I do like the over, though. I'm not going to lie. I do like the over for sure. And then the, uh, the night game is Panthers and Packers. Uh, minus 8 for the Packers. Minus 8 for the Packers, and the over-under being 51 and a half. Love the Packers minus 8, and I love the under. $5 turns into 65 with that. What do you guys think? Those two pretty feasible? I think those are reasonable bets. Bills minus 5 and a half with the over at 49, and then Packers minus 8 with the over-under 51 and a half. I like the under in that game. I think the Packers score about 95% of the points in that game. I mean, those are two gimmies, though, for money lines. I think you got Bills, you got Packers regardless. But that's not a fantastic payout. 25 makes 44. So, you know what I'm saying? What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Clemson wins easy. We got Clemson. Oh, I think so, too. I think we got Clemson over Notre Dame with, uh, with good old... Um, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, McKenzie, we did post now your nice number six. Two spots taken there. 
Uh, Trevor Lawrence. Trevor Lawrence being back helps. I was going to say future future NFL New York Jet. Not your nicest post. I don't know. I really like this Bills. Bills minus five and a half with the over. I'm going to take that. I'm going to take that, and I'm going to take the Packers with the under of 51 and a half. I like that. I think that's I think that's fair. So 25 wins. Wow. That's not bad. 25 wins 326. I just scare. I just scares me. I don't know. The Packers could score 45 by themselves. You know? The Packers could score 45 in their own. And they might. What do you guys think? Anybody have any uh anybody have any advice here? I think Bills my, Bills five and a half over is a lock. That's in my opinion. I think that's a lock. Ethan, have a good night, man. You killed it tonight. Uh Jersey number five. Jersey five double. Christopher Hannon and Dustin Harmon. Ethan, see you tomorrow, man. We'll be on at 2 and 8. Chris Hannon, Harmon. Tenders, Optic 2. Five spots left and Naughty or Nice 6. HTA encased. Optic. Let me know. Let me know if there's anything else, guys. I don't know. I might take that, to be honest. Bills over. <laughs> hey, energy cards are big. Energy cards are massive. And I like that for some reason. I don't know. I don't hate the over either. I don't know. I'll think about it tomorrow. I'll tell you what I guys. I'll tell you what I guys pick. I'll tell you guys what I pick before we start tomorrow at the two p.m. show. I'll debate on it all night. What do you guys think, Robert? What do you think? Do you bet on football? Is anybody a bet on football? What do you guys think? Are you guys taking that that Packers over or under? Robert closes out another. Robert, let's see what you got. Whoa. <laughs> you think Buffalo can make up 23 and a half points in 35 seconds? What do you mean? All right, Rob. All right, Rob, you got a personal for the Panini encased. All right, Rob, let's go, man. Panini encased. Let's have some fun. What do we got? We got two. We got one. We got one. Two boxes in here. All right, Robert. Two boxes of Panini encased. One or two, brother. One or two. You pick. This is big time here. One, that was a good pick. I like one. All right, let's see what you got. Panini encased. 
Two autos, two memorabilia cards, and one being a slabbed auto. Here's your slab right here. There's your slab. Set that off to the side. Thank you, Bradley. Appreciate you. Appreciate the shout with the knife skills. Nunchuck skills, bow hunting skills. All right, here we go. I'm gonna I'm gonna crack this right here. You can still see, I don't want I don't want to spoil the auto. I know the auto is right at the back. So. I don't want to spoil it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I don't want to spoil it. Oh my goodness. First card's a bronze jersey. LeBron James. Jersey to 149. Let's go. Nasty start. Vaulted veteran LeBron James. 81 to 149. Our second card is a Ben Simmons. Ben Simmons to 149. Oh my goodness. Best box so far. Hot start. First memorabilia card is a Jason. Oh, thought it was a memorabilia card. That's a base. Sorry, two memorabilia cards. Jason Tatum to 99. Oh my goodness. Fantastic start to the box. Braun. Ben Simmons. Jason Tatum base to 99. And your auto. Cam Reddish. Three color RPA. <laughs> oh my God. Let's go, man. Cam Reddish on card, auto to 25. Doesn't get much better than this. All right, I need to see what's in this slab because this could be the best Panini and Case box we've ever seen. So far, the best we have seen. Here we go. Here's your slab. Your slab is going to be a Beckett 10 auto signed rookie on card Jalen Noel. Jalen Noel, one color RPA to 99. 10 auto for the Minnesota T Wolves. That was an awesome. Awesome. Panini and case box. This can not register big time. Get a sleeve for that. Cam Reddish three color RPA. A Jason Tatum base to 99. A Ben Simmons to 149. And a LeBron James jersey to 149. To go along with a Jalen Noel to 99. What an awesome box that was. Probably the best Fernini and Case box we've had so far. Robert, you killed it. Just purchased a mystery jersey to be open live. Let's do it. Let's go. Yeah, Robert, we'll post that as a break. Let's try to post that as a break. Maybe we can get some people to help you out, Rob. I'm going to get these sorted and boxed up for you. Robert, great job, my man. You killed it with that. Okay. Did I see uh Jason, you got a personal jersey. Uh let me see what numbers they go up to. Yep, 65. Jason, if you want to pick a box, they go all the way up to number 65. All the way up to number 65, if you want to give me a box number. Uh we broke today all the way up to like number 30. So if you want to start at 30, we go up to 65. Uh 33, you got it. Let me run and grab it.
Okay. Thirty-three. We got a personal for Jason Ricker. I know your boss is my address by now, so I expect a Christmas present. Absolutely. All right, Jason. Here you go. Thirty-three is one of my keynote numbers. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. That is true. Dang it. All right. Jason, good luck, my man. Let's see what you got for your complete personal jersey. Nice. Buffalo Bills. Stud. Stud, stud, stud. Tremaine Edmonds. Tremaine Edmonds is a good player. He's a beast, to be honest. He is a beast. I like that. Tremaine Edmonds. I love the Eagles. <laughs> Jason, good hit. That's nice, dude. Tremaine Edmonds. He has two brothers in the NFL. Trey Edmonds and Terrell Edmonds. Kind of like the Watt brothers. Or the Ball brothers. Lavello looks good in preseason. That's true. Jason, good hit. Yeah, Rob, we can. Want that other panini encased? Let's try to break that. Yes, we are getting that panini and case posted as well. Panini and case will be posted. Whew! Let's go. Cool. That was a good night. That was fun. So far, I'm still not done. That was a fun time. Naughty or nice six. Still a couple spots. Panini encased number two is posted. On the website. Robert, what do you think? You guys saw the potential in that product. And I'll tell you what, that was our best box. I'll tell you what, wasn't even our best slab card. Wasn't even our best slab. I and mean, that was the best box. So there's some serious potential. Jalen Wells, decent. It's kind of a decent pick. All right, Rob, let me know. Well, we saw LeBron jersey. We saw Ben Simmons jersey. We had uh, Jason Tatum. So we got another personal as well. All right, Jeremy. Yeah, Jeremy, we got uh, box 40, 45. Would you like that one? We got box 45, Jeremy. Or if you want, we could do, I think we have box 50 left. 45 is all you. 45 is all you. All right, Jeremy, good luck, brother. Let's see what you got for the personal. Hello, Tyler. How are you? Good to see you in the chat. 
My little OJ Simpson gloves on tonight. OJ. These gloves fit though. For the most part, I usually break them. Jeremy, good luck. Here we go. Yeah. Beauty. Absolute beauty. Jeremy Cooley with an absolute banger. We got a kid out of the University of Wyoming is leading the AFC East. Buffalo Bills to a playoff spot. Definitely potential MVP candidate in the upcoming seasons. I would be very surprised if he didn't win an MVP in the next three years. Josh Allen. Two Bills. We're taking the over, Mark. We are taking the over. It's a sign from the man upstairs. Good hit. Will we be getting anything else with this box, Jeremy? Let's see. Josh Allen. No, sir. Oh, eight spots? That's a six spots break. Six spot break. Hold on, Robert. We'll fix that in one second. Josh Allen, what a beauty. With the OJ gloves on, he pulls a bill. I pulled an OJ jersey earlier. <laughs> That'll be epic. Jeremy, nice hit, dude. That's sweet. Cool. Jeremy, congrats. Really great personal. Love to see that. Hey, Robert, we fixed in case two. In case two is fixed, let's go through this again. Oh, you know what? Stupid. All right, cool. All right, Robert looks like he's guaranteed three spots. Robert's in for three. All right, so we got to help out Robert up and fill this up. Robert's in for three spots. Panini and Case Basketball. Let me go through quickly what Panini and Basketball, Panini and Case Basketball will entail. Two autographs, two memorabilia cards per box on average, okay? We got Zions, John Morant, you're looking for Tyler Hero. We pulled a guy, um, I can see him. I can see him, I know his number. He is the other rookie for the Memphis Grizzlies. His name is uh, 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 Grant. Uh, come on. It slipped my head right now. But we got we pulled Cam Reddish. We actually pulled him out of contenders. Graham? Randy Graham? No. Not sure, but I can't remember it. But we pulled some really cool stuff out of this in case product. Two memorabilia cards, two autographs. Robert's in for three. We got three spots left. We can fill this up and do another encased break. And then a hero comes along and my best Yeah, Tyler Hero would be amazing. Tyler Hero sells for huge dollar bills. We're talking dollar dollar bills, y'all. Dollar dollar bills, y'all. Okay. All right, Robert's in for three spots. Who's going to help Robert close this out? We'll give it a minute or so, see if anybody else wants to help Robert in this. If not, looks like Robert may take this as a personal. But I'm excited to rip this stuff. Now. I love Panini and Case. It's one of my favorite products on the planet. Um, it's just awesome stuff. Just awesome stuff. What's the most valuable rookie this year? Uh, in this product, Zion. Zion, John Morant. Probably go hand-in-hand in, hand in terms of value for rookies. Probably go hand-in-hand in, hand in terms of value. Zion is just so valuable. Zion is just crazy valuable. His name is... We pulled, uh, we pulled a Tua out of Panini Origins. Tua is uh, 17. That was a huge card. We pulled a Justin Herbert three patch card. 
It wasn't an auto, but it was nasty. Joey Burrow, patch card. Yeah, Robert, you killed it, man. Yeah, that, that Tyler Hero we pulled out of, uh, that was Panini 1-1. One one. It was solid, too. You pulled the Tyler Hero auto out of Panini 1-1. One one. That was our auto. That was a great hit. Yeah, he's awesome. I wish he wouldn't have cut his hair, though. His short hair is just not it. Yeah, he's good as a fantasy QB. Pretty good. Two, Robert, you hit all the good ones. Brandon Clark. Brandon Clark. We hit a Brandon Clark auto in the contenders. That was a good one. Is anybody can help Robert close this out? Three spots left. This is a six spot break. There's only six divisions in the NBA. Will this be another Robert personal? I don't know if I like his short hair. But hey, he's an NFL player. He can wear whatever hair he wants. Love that. All right, Robert. Looks like it may be all you, my man. Nebraska. Victorious over Rutgers. Where's Grayson? He's got to be pumped. Ball State beat Buffalo 38-28 in the MAC championship. Ball State 38-28. Minus 13. Loser. All right, Rob. You got it, dude. Robert, thanks a bunch, my man. Two. Box number two. Let's see what we got. Here's our slab, man. Please let it be a Zion or something. Please let it be a Zion or a Jock. Come on, man. Come on now. There's our slab right up there. I'm going to open this pack up here. I don't want to give anything away. You can still see it up here. You can still see me. to the back. All right, your first card. Not sure why that is uncooperative. Check that out one more time. Weird. Okay. First card is a DeMar DeRozan Spurs jersey hit. DeMar DeRozan Spurs to 199. Next hit is going to be a Kobe White rookie patch to 199. Kobe White was killing it in their last preseason game. There's your two memorabilia cards. This is going to be our base. Joel Embiid. 25 of 25. Joel Embiid, base. And your auto to 99 is Isaiah Roby. Two color, or two patch, kind of like a dual patch, what we call these, dual patch RPA. Isaiah Roby for the Magic, I'm sorry, the Dallas Mavericks. The Dallas Mavericks, Isaiah Roby on card, auto. And here we go. Here we go. Here's the slab. Come on now. One time for Robert. One time for Robert. The slab is going to be San Antonio Spurs. This kid's actually a stud. He's very underrated. 
In my honest opinion, I think this kid is a stud. Number to 99, it is rookie notable signatures, Keldon Johnson. Keldon Johnson, notable sigs. I like that, though. He's good, man. He's a good player. Just doesn't get a ton of love. Nine with a 10 auto. Isaiah Roby and Keldon Johnson. The last box blew this one away, man. The last box kind of blew this one away. We added B. DeRozan. This is a great hit, though. Kobe White patch. Labeled materials 10. There you go. Robert, thanks so much, my man, for helping us, helping us do some cards tonight. Had some fun with this product. We'll get this sorted. Don't sleep on Kelvin Johnson's a good player. like players of Spurs pass, they're in good hands. I agree with that. I agree with that for sure. All right. Naughty or nice six hasn't moved in a minute. More breaks coming up this weekend, guys. We will have a Saturday afternoon break. So tomorrow, I'll be back with you guys tomorrow and Saturday night as well. I've got two tomorrow, two and eight, and then we'll have Garrett for Sunday. Robert got his personal. But guys, thanks so much for all your support for the UA Live Break Room, man. Had an absolute blast tonight. We will uh, get some more stuff posted. We'll try to get that new uh, mini helmet break up and also a platinum helmet break as well. Have some more stuff for this weekend. We'll have some more complete, some jerseys. Uh, finish out this Naughty or Nice series number two as well. Try to move into series number three before that Christmas holiday. But guys, thank you so much for all your support for the UA Live Breaks. It is much, much appreciated. You guys absolutely knocked it out of the park tonight. Had a ton of fun. I'll be back in just a little while. We got a 2 p.m. break tomorrow. So come excited for that. I am excited. We'll try to get some more stuff up for then. Until next time, guys, thank you again so much for all your support. You know, having some fun in here. Holiday season, open some breaks, get some Christmas presents. Until next time, guys, 2 p.m. tomorrow, 2 p.m. Central Standard Time. We'll talk bills. We'll talk Packers. Uh, 2 p.m., Richard. 2 p.m., Richard. Not your nice little be number one. Didn't see any movement in that. Um, so we will sign it off right there, guys. Thank you so much for all your support. You ain't live break style. We're going to sign it off, and we'll see you guys tomorrow afternoon.